Welcome. This is the energy vibration lays in reading for um the Leas. <laughs> Sun, Moon, and Rising Sun. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. I want to say to each and every person, um, this is good. This is a wonderful time. I want to ask the universal angels and guides for divine protection. Um, for you, Leas, whatever is transpiring. I love you guys so much, honestly. And please like and share these videos. I am um, taking back the time from the extended reading. And remember, my readings are timeless, ladies and gentlemen, because we're vibrating on different energy vibration reading. So you can check out the third quartal of the year 2018 or the year 2017 because my readings are timeless. Um, I realize that a lot of people have been saying it, but I have always said my reading is timeless because the energy vibration reading and we all do not vibrate on the same energy vibration for the extended reading. I have take back. I used to do extended reading for an hour. I'm only going to do it for half an hour because, um, you guys weren't aware that you were just getting a hour reading inclusive love money career um and you were getting an hour reading now i'm taking it back to half an hour okay it's just a dollar 99 and a lot of people weren't aware that it was a dollar 99 for the reading and it was uh, um for an hour but now i'm taking that down okay ladies and gentlemen i'm calling in the light beams of the leos pure light beams um god and goddesses of the leas uh, light beams energy workers uh, please come in and show the leas what is going to be coming up in this quartel so um we have the energy of the angman this is a water energy i'm seeing some of you in october is taking it easy whatever it is you're going within your understanding you're planning so for some of you in october it's going within planning and trying to come out of an issue and come out of a situation so this is going to be good it's going to be wonderful and it's going to be positive because by going within you're trying to balance out yourself some of you are dealing with a pisces and a pisces could be helping you out to show you how to do that so it is october is the is the month of the Tauren and um, um, tower and the month of October is that something unexpected is going to leave some of us lives and then you are looking at what to how to plan your way forward we have strength coming up in the month of November we have strength this is a good um, month for you guys because you're going to be finding the inner strength maybe the energy of strength is going to be coming in to help you okay so don't be surprised when because a lot of people do not like the energy of strength but energy of strength is just telling you that you have the power within you to get over whatever is going on okay so the energy of strength has to do with you Leah so November is going to be a very very good month for you Leah's it's about endurance it's about endurance and you're going to be in enduring whatever that is happening around you and it's going to be good okay so what does the Leah have for December Leah said moon horizon sign what do they have for December you have the chariot victory and success okay Leah's hit me okay all right so the energy of the chariot is movement but it's also victory and success the energy of the chariot has to do that some of you are going to be overcoming a situation and at the end of a reading a spread it is always about you victoriously and successfully coming over a situation that you are dealing with this could be a situation that you are dealing with that was uh, um, you know keeping your life in such a stressful mood and position and finally you're going to be stand up to the injustice and equality finally someone someone is going to step in on your behalf and um, and, and really really um, doing something to end a situation that has been going someone is going to be stepping on your behalf so for you Leah's November and December is going to be um, good and there's nothing wrong with October October is just as if uh, what is happening in October is that you're going within what is happening in October is that you're going within you're going within to um, plan your, a new start plan movement forward so um, it is actually a really, a, you know, a call upon the angels and guide. 444 just came up. 444 just came up. Call upon the angels and guides because whatever is happening or whatever is transpiring, the universal angels and guides are coming in to help you, Leah. So, 
um, see October as a you know one of those restful months, you Leos. Okay, so we have the Prince of Cups in the reverse. I don't know what is happening to these people. Um, I can sh shuffle the cards. You can see me shuffling the cards. But whoever this person is, this person is a young person between the age of eighteen and forty-five. Whatever is transpiring is that this person is in the reverse. And why this person is in the reverse is because this person is not vibrating on a positive uh, mood. Now, this person can be a uh, Pisces, but um, some of you, this is a Pisces. Um, some of you, a Pisces could be helping you. Um, to make changes in your life because the energy of the angman it is the energy of the Pisces and the Pisces could be coming in and helping you to make changes in your life and to give you um, deeper um, balance okay some of you are dealing with a young um, Pisces cancer or a scorpion person and you are trying to find um, find um, you know endure with this person because this person seems to be doing and you know whatever is happening do with the endurance family is going to be there family is going to be helping you and you're going to be coming out on top family is going to be important end of november to december family is going to be important and they are going to be helping you out and moving you forward because um whatever the issue is or whatever the situation is whoever this person is could be a child could be a child that is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and trust me this child is creating all of these uh, situations for you but it's as if the universe is going to be stepping in it's as if the universe realize you know this child has been doing so much and has been you know you are so stressed out from this child and the universe is going to step in and that's where your strength came up in the month of November because you know the universe decided no you know this child needs to learn some lesson whoever this child is uh, and it is a family member for some of you or it is someone this is definitely a family member whoever this person is is definitely a family member because now the universe is going to step in and said no this is going to be ending no you know you need to know your position and you need to know your place what you're doing is wrong so some of you are going to be finding the endurance uh, um, and you're going to definitely be victorious and successful. So whatever issue that you guys are having with family and family could be um, your own family, but it could be your family on the work floor, or it could be people who you connect with, who you feel as if they're your family, whatever the issue is, whatever the situation is, because it could be your family at school, because if you're going to school or you're studying in any huge organization, these are your family, you're going to be victorious and successful. You're definitely going to be victorious and successful the ten of cups is here you're definitely going to be victorious and successful now we have the queen of cups and whoever this queen of cups is some of you are dealing with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion woman whoever this person is this person is in reverse they are not working on the positive energy vibration some of you this could be affecting you that you're not feeling very nurtured towards this person because um, towards this child or towards a person because you realize that this person has done you some injustice and you need to step back and that's what you're doing in the month of November you're basically stepping back and saying hey I need to connect with myself because this person has gone over all boundaries they can and I need to rebalance myself and bring myself back to balance so that I can understand how to deal with this person so this person could be a mother it could be a child Whoever this person is, this person could be a friend at work, this person could be a sister, whoever this person is and this friend is, you're definitely going to be overcoming whatever the situation and whatever they have brought in your life. You're definitely going to be overcoming this issue because we're seeing the injustice and inequality of this person coming out. Some of you are going to be realizing that you're dealing with either your partner and their mom or um, this is, could be a friend and their mom. This could be um, your, your husband or your partner, whoever this person is. Uh, these water sign people are coming up and you're trying to figure out a way how you can balance out a situation to deal with these people because this has been a really 
unstable situation and really if you notice these two people are in the reverse so these two people could be working against you and their family members and you're you're gonna be enduring this and you're gonna be come out of this very good because you're gonna be enduring this and realizing and standing your ground and let people know how far to go and how far not to go with you okay so this is definitely what is going to be happening this is definitely I was walking in the rain my hair is <laughs> all over the place okay so victory and success you're going to endure the situation whatever situation you're going through you are going to be finding endurance you're going to be finding um really um positive way of i uh, because some of you are really these are family members some of your family member real bloodlines that you're um dealing with a situation with the hangman is here this is transition this is the energy of pluto whenever pluto comes in this has to do with the pisces okay um you gotta be aware because there is two uranus and pluto and pluto this has to be this has to do with the pisces so you gotta be aware of this that whatever um that is transpiring and whatever is happening there is a pisces that some of you are dealing with and um the pisces can be um the some of you are dealing with a pisces it could be a scorpion and a cancer this could be a scorpion on a cancer so you got to be aware because whenever pluto comes up pluto um uh, remove is a transition and it is a scorpion the energy of the scorpion it is a transition okay because pluto is coming in and um is bringing transition to an issue to a situation the moon is the illusion of seeing the unseen and this has to do with Pluto this is the energy of transition that is coming in so a Pisces could be coming in to bring some transition in your world so you Leah's whoever you are a Pisces could be coming in to bring some transition in your world strength comes up November is going to be a good Uranus comes up some of you on unexpected news is going to be coming in that is going to bring a transition and this is going to be very positive unexpected news is definitely going to be coming in that is going to bring a transition um this is something you weren't expecting whenever uranius comes up some of you could be and and, and aquarius could be leaving your life unexpectedly okay so um, um expect that an aquarius could be also leaving your life a resolution to a situation and a problem that you have been going through and this is the reason why in Nova, in december you're going to be victorious and successful okay and uh, you are going to have a surprise congratulations you leas i love you leas so much congratulations because what is transpiring is that after the endurance of a situation that has been transpiring after the endurance of a situation that has been transpiring the numerous come in and you are victoriously going to be successfully coming out of a situation but also what is going to be happening and transpiring is that some luck is going to be here for you too that some luck is going to be coming in so you're going to be victorious and successful unknown events is going to take place where the universe could be coming in and just helping you out and giving you a push and a, a very positive push Sagittarians are here in Sagittarians are going to be taking you in a voyage or Sagittarians are going to be moving you um, because whoever some of you are dealing with this person is uh, um, far away from you this is a Pisces cancer scorpion between the age of 18 and 45 some of you you could be going on vacation with this person to visit family um, there could be planning um, in November going into December whatever this is but whoever this person is there's a Sagittarian that is going to be helping you to control the situation and control this person okay and when I say control you're not supposed to control people but it's like a Sagittarian or a voyage this person you gotta be careful because this person could be coming to visit you as a family member and some of you it is best to say no because you knew what this person has done and be and this person being in your house or being around you you have to be very careful Morris is coming up and there is definitely a shake-up in the family um, that is going to be happening 
um, Mars is coming up and there's definitely a shake-up in the family that is going to be happening when Mars comes in Mars is um, opening up something revealing something that was unknown about a family or a family issue revealing something that you were not aware of about a family issue and Mars is coming in to shake up that affi family um, because there was some on um, uh, some things that needs to be healed in your family and Mars is going to be coming up some action family um, there is going to some actions that is going to be taken against the family or um, action the family needs to take an action against a situation that is going on okay the Queen of Cups some of you um, have the alchemy some of you could be dealing with a Queen of Cups whoever this person is it could be a mother it could be um, it could be a mother, it could be a friend, it could be a sister, it could be whoever this person is and however this person is affecting you in your life, they could be using negative energy. So you got to be aware of this. Alchemist meaning working with the unseen world, okay? Because a lot of us are not aware what our friends and family and so will do whenever they see that you are moving um, uh, moving up the ladder in life, okay? You will not be aware of Whoever this person is, this person you could have had an issue with. Um, sometimes you don't even think that the issue was that. And this person is using alchemist. Alchemist is the form of negative energy. Now, a Virgo could be helping you to understand what is transpiring between you and this person. Okay, so a Virgo is going to be entering because Virgos are very psychic. They know things, they feel things. That this is why they're very quiet because these Virgos are understanding about certain things and about working with the unseen world. Now, a Virgo could be helping you, or a Virgo is helping this lady to send you negative energy or whatever but whatever is happening the, it is going to be ending because um, the universe is going to be realizing what is to inspire and divine intervention because there's a resolution is going to be coming in and whenever Uranus come because you're in, you have been enduring something for quite some time whenever Uranus comes this Uranus is just going to be messing up everything Uranus is going to say hey we're taking this shit down lady you need to stop do something with your life and you need to stop so a Virgo is definitely going to come in and helping you out because this Virgo is going to either let you know something about the Pisces Cancer or Scorpion woman, who, what she uh, or, um, um, he, he or she is going to inform you because Virgos, the alchemist, and definitely is a child. Some of you are dealing with a child. Some of you are definitely dealing with a child, and the child is the Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion between the ages of 18 and 45. Now, this child, um, whatever is transpiring, um, some of you are going to be finding out that this child, either their friends or so, have done some injustice. I'm seeing luck is going to be coming out for you guys. I'm seeing luck coming out for you guys. So whatever that you're going through in this third period, luck is coming in. You, you have yes, luck. You're going to be victorious overcoming a situation because luck is coming in. Um, your outcomes is going to be luck is coming in because you're going to be overcoming whatever this issue and the situation is. Pluto transition is here. There is going to be an end to a situation that is transpiring. Pluto is coming in. There is going to be an end to a situation that is going on. Definitely. It's as if Pluto comes in and Pluto is going to release you from that negative energy. Long-term stability is going to be here because Uranus is bringing a resolution to an issue and a problem that you have been going through. This is going to be coming up in November. An issue and a problem that you have been going through. Uranus comes in and it's going to help you and you are going to be having long-term stability. The numerous and victory and success in the star. I gotta let you guys see this in December luck the star oh I am so happy for you guys I'm so happy for you guys this is just so powerful so beautiful you Leo's 
please remember to check out the extended reading December is going to be a fantastic month start calling up and asking for help from the universal angels and guides because Uranus is going to be stepping in and guarding you from issues and situation that has been transpiring okay Uranus is going to step in and guarding you from issues and situation that has been transpiring now there is going to be the shake up in a family with a man you men are going to be having some actions you have to take some actions about your family so you men maybe um you were cut off not to see the kids and that sort of a thing it's christmas um some of you are hangry impatient some of you need to stand up and take the leadership step in a situation okay oh i'm <coughs> sorry so Woo. you men there is going to be a shake-up in a family and you men are going to have issues with the kids there's definitely going to be a shake-up in a family and you men are going to be having issues with the kid I am seeing a situation with a child is now going to be ended in the month of October whatever that was transpiring whatever that was in was has been happening I'm seeing you handing this situation with this child uh, in October okay definitely but you're coming out of this quarter with luck you're coming out of the squad will not especially with a Pisces cancer scorpion woman whoever the Pisces cancer scorpion woman is and this Virgo it could be a partner it could, they could be partner so let's say that this woman is a sister-in-law uh, um, or a, a sister or a friend and their partner is a Virgo you're gonna be lucky over them because whatever they have done it's gonna be coming out and you're gonna have some luck over them whatever they have done is coming out and you're definitely going to be having some luck over them this is the Queen of Cups and a Virgo these two people could have been married or in a relationship if you know who these two people are you're gonna be coming out very lucky out of them because their downfall is going to be your luck their downfall is going to be your luck um leos you're having a beautiful quarter whatever is happening whatever is transpiring you have a beautiful quarter you virgo men are definitely going to be having some issues with family and issues with a child whatever is happening i'm seeing a child that is overseas is having some issues and some situation okay i'm seeing the ending coming to a child it could be an accident um because this is like foreign travels so and um there's going to be a shake up in a family i it could be an accident because i'm seeing just so you know unexpected it's unexpected but um and it is pluto a transition so it's going to be affecting the family and especially the man has to stand up for this issue okay so you men it is a situation with a child um, the child could be overseas or the child could be living overseas and there's an issue you have to jump in and uh, bring the situation to balance so be aware of this okay then we have the seventh chakra Archangel Uriel and this is good because whenever Archangel Uriel Uriel comes in it means that there is definitely an issue a situation that has to be looked at Um, some of you are, are on the good part. Some of you are definitely on the right part. 88 money is unexpected money. You're going to be receiving. Some of you are definitely on the right part. There's going to be some unexpected money that is going to be coming in. Definitely on the right part. Some of you. Okay. Um, you guys have one seven and eight 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 okay so one seven and eight 
that's what you guys have now the seventh chakra with Archangel Uriel is the beautiful angels okay um, and call and he's the 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 fire of the gods and he wear a brilliant shining crystal okay crowned with the vibration I love Archangel Uriel with this passionate connection to the divine she brings great power to the seventh energy center which is called the crown chakra and is located at the top of the head whenever this is flowing freely and challenging of information and inspiration from wonderful things in the spirit world this could be also a time of great intuition for you and guidance from the higher self and the awareness so allow yourself to be quiet in mind and listen listen now is a great time to get connected the assistance from spirit is great whether it is the present of an ascendance master or power angel or it's Archangel Uriel but whatever is happening Archangel Uriel is watching over you guys in this month call upon this quarter call upon him in the month of October November and December call upon Archangel Uriel to help you in whatever way he can help you this time because he's going to be coming in and helping you guys out 11 11 11 there is something going on um, detach whatever is going on detach detach and send peace see you the lady let the white dove out it's all about peace peace detach detach ladies and gentlemen whatever is going on just detach because the energies of the powers of the God is going to be working for you in your favor so detach from the situation whoever the Pisces, cancer or scorpion person is between the age of 18 and 45 detach from this person because you know something each and every one of us we have kids but we have to deal with them and uh, what we expect of our kids is not what happened and we just have to help them to get out of things you can love people you can love people from afar detach let there be peace ladies and gentlemen I am wishing you a beautiful beautiful October November and December detach from whatever is transpiring let the universe know that I will take no more namaste